Hey everybody, welcome to Always Bored, Never Boring. Today I'm going to be showing you one of the quickest and dirtiest paint jobs I have ever done. And because it is Easter, we are going to be painting some alien eggs. These are resin miniatures from Prodos Games from the now defunct Alien vs Predator The Hunt Begins board game. And yeah, we're going to paint them up really quickly, really easily as a special Easter treat. And we've got to do this quickly because I only had this idea on Saturday night, so I had to do it fast. We've started with a Chaos Black Spray Prime, and now I'm going to Lead Belcher, and we're going to paint the base first. Which isn't something I would normally do, but with these scenic bases from Alien vs Predator, the bases are kind of integral to the miniature, and it's quite difficult sometimes to uh, paint the base after you've painted the miniature. So we're going to do two coats of lead belcher to get a good coating over all those metallic elements. We're now going to Celestra Grey and I'm going to water this down slightly and I'm going to put a coat over all of the eggs and I'm only doing one coat. Now normally I would say that do two coats for a good solid colour base but I want these eggs to be mottled and um, varying in tone so I'm doing one thin coat, so there'll be patches that are darker, patches that are lighter. And now I'm switching to Ulthuan Grey, and I'm going to do a heavy dry brush over those eggs, picking out all of the raised details and all of the horrible gribbly bits and little tendrils. We're now going to Null Oil, and I'm going to very carefully apply Null Oil to just the metallic elements. Like I say, we're doing a very quick job here, so uh, most of what we're going to be doing is, is going to be done with the washes. So just being careful not to get it all over the eggs, because we'll be doing those with different washes, but just picking out all those metallic details. Including that rim right around the edge of the base. And now we've got Agrax Earthshade, Null Oil and Athonian Camo Shade and we're going to paint the eggs now. And this is just trial and error and experimentation. I did multiple coats of different combinations of washes. My first wash was two parts Null Oil, two parts Agrax Earthshade and uh, maybe four parts Athonian Camo Shade. I did one full coat over that. When it dried, I did a second coat of the same mix. Then I did a, a mix which had more Agrax in it. And then I actually blotched on some pure Agrax in areas and pure non oil in areas just to get that mottled, shiny, metallic, horrible, nasty look to the eggs. So it's just a case of gradually building up those shades one at a time, experimenting until you find um, a tone and a shade of dark metallic -y green that you like. And that's what I came up with. And now I'm switching to Rakarth Flesh because some of these eggs are actually hatching and you can see just the tops of the face huggers inside. So I'm thinning the Rakarth slightly, two thin coats just to pick out the fleshy face hugger bits. And then those face huggers are going to get a coat of Agrax Earthshade just to bring the details back out. You don't need to be careful obviously about getting any over the eggs and stuff because it'll just add to the mottled effect that you've already achieved with your um, washes. And then I'm going to back to Rakarth Flesh and I'm thinning it down and I'm just picking out the details on those face huggers, the most raised areas, the tops of the spines and any legs that are hanging out. And that is done it took next to no time at all you can obviously go back you can add highlights to the eggs you can dry brush the metal areas you can add extra highlights add some rust effects if you want to but it's easter who's got time for that go and eat some chocolate crack open a beer sit in your back garden and enjoy the sun and call that a done deal Thank you so much for watching this incredibly quick and dirty painting guide. If you have liked the video, please consider pressing the like button. If you have really enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing if you don't already do so. And hopefully, I will see you all again very soon. Happy Easter, everybody. And make sure you stick to the chocolate eggs. Bye-bye.